Hi and welcome to Keep Buzz Creative Flow. We are taking part in Junk Journal January, January, which is hosted by Meg Journals and by Get Messy Art Journal. You can find them on social media. And our our it's routine. Our, we're on number five and it's routine. So what was in my head? What what was in my head? Okay, first of all, um I've got what I did here, so I just cut up, I'll just show you, I had a planner on the wall, so there you see, sorry, the, the back of it still got a bit of glue on it stuck to the table, that's it, um, so this planner was from Ryman's and it was on the wall, like showing my uni dates and stuff like that, so all I did was cut it smaller and then I Put this so I just PVA glued the actual tea bag over it and then I left a slight gap in the middle so that if I wanted to put it up over as a tab I could so yeah that's all I've done I've just glued that to an old calendar so yeah use use up your old wall planners and calendars you can totally do this um yeah that's all i did and then i just let that dry overnight before i used it today um i've got this envelope see i don't know how i'm going to do this because the first thing i do in the morning is have a green herbal tea i usually use this one um it's a green tea by kirkland and i have two cups of hot water in a massive mug um, that's what I normally have, but during the day and that um, I do have these pocket pocketies, the organic ones. They're very, very nice, very, very nice. If you've tried them, you know. But their packaging is gorgeous as well. Um, and then I've pulled out this tag which says, "If you don't know where you're going, any road will get you there." So it's just a sticker up on this upcycled um, wedding card, which has got like a texture to it, which is pretty cool. And I was thinking. Maybe we could put it on this page um, as a little pocket. So shall we start with that first? Actually, so all that. So this is just recycled, upcycled, and I, oh, I pulled out um, the botanical garden, which I have shown you before. That that's from the works, just called botanical garden, and then there's this as well, which is from. It's by a company called Art Studio and it's decoupage paper and it comes with two other ones and I think it was one ninety nine or one pound. So yeah, this is what it is. It's just called um so you get three different designs. And it's just called newspaper decoupage paper by Art Studio. So yeah, so we're gonna be using this one today because it has some cool it has a birdie, it has like the time for the routine. Um, and I thought this was pretty funny. Well, not funny, but I suppose it's real life. It says, I make, I think it must say, the same route. My house, my job, I'm pretty tired of it all. I dream when it is, it's a it's a wonderful story and nobody will know it. Never, never, never. Why, why am I not a bird? They can fly so far how they, how they once, but I am not so free. Every day I make the same route. My house, my job, I am tired of it all. And then they talk about bike. And I was like, oh, okay. So they're kind of talking about their routine as well. So I thought, we've got to include this. We've got to. We've got stuff. And healthy eating. I try to focus on that. Try to have as much drink as possible. Um, and then I've also pulled out this ATC book. It's so old. Very old. Um, sorry, I just keep hitting the light. I am standing to craft as well. Actually, I don't know what's straight now. Oh, there we go. Um, so it's this ATC collection and it is, it says leisurearts.com and it was from 2005. I know, crazy. So this first, oh no, not that one. So this first one actually just says imagine. So I was going to hope to... 
pull this bit out. I'm wondering if I should do the read as well. I suppose we could see if we can um, incorporate it because I try to read before I go to bed. Um, I'll leave the hat alone with its ribbon and all. I'm just going to use, yeah, I'm going to try to incorporate that somewhere. So we've got all our bits and bobs. I've got some double sided tape. Could I get the wet glue as well? Might as well. I've got Anita's Tacky PVA glue. So should I just put it in like this old? I'm just going to pop it in here. That's it. And I've got some double sided tape as well. Okay, just getting a glue brush. Spatula thingy, I don't know what it's called. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna I am gonna use the dry glue to incorporate this here. So let's just start off with that, shall we? Just needs We will close the bottom section as well so the tag doesn't fall out. Okay, so I'm just going to cover up the fact file. This is a grassland, grassland, so it's found in grassland banks and hedgerows. And it's from the daisy family, so they're like little daisies. Very cute. I'm just gonna pop that there. It kind of um bands it bands that um flowers, doesn't it? You know what I mean. You probably don't know what I mean, but it's alright. <laughs> um sorry, I keep moving this. Um light like i said i was stand i'm standing up so i'm just gonna quickly go in because you're going smaller on yeah i'm just gonna go in here see if we can just add something on the top here see i haven't refilled my i haven't refilled my what do you call it staple gun not staple gun, the staple, stapler. Actually, that's interesting. Yeah, that was from one of the other projects, wasn't it? I could add that. A little bit of black. Or I could just add some grunged um, paper. What shall we do? Yeah, I think we just stick with, let's stick with that for now. A little bit of, just to create a bit of interest. Actually, which way do you want to go? Yeah, let's do that. Hope you are okay. Thank you for subscribing if you're new here as well. Much appreciated. Actually, am I going to ruin the... She can go to the side, can't it? I was going to say, am I ruining the actual main focal point? So I'm not... I'm in two minds of using this. So I don't know. What do you think if it will be... I mean, I'll just put some of doily as well. I can come to the party. Uh, so I know it does go with the green, but then I'm thinking that is going to be too big for this page. But what my idea was like when we wake up in the morning, that's the first thing we do. We like sit on the edge of the bed 
um, slowly bring ourselves round and think about the day, give ourselves oxygen, we feed our brains, so it helps us think. Um, some of us pray. I'm gonna that this is why I thought I'd use this book for prayer. Um because that's what we do in the morning and the evening. Um really tr we try to do it well I try to do it when I can. Um so it's all about trying to just get it in your routine. Also just being thankful for like the different things we have. Feels a bit strange because I've posted every single day through December and everything as well. And today I'm quite late because it was just a crazy busy day at work. So I do apologise. This is going to be a late upload. I will include the flowers as well. Everybody loves to see flowers. I'm very inquisitive. I'm so glad I get to drive around a lot for work because I've Today we saw some beautiful lilies at Fajin's house. And I was just like, oh. And um, the physio who's with me, Zubi. Hi, Zubi. Um, he was like, I'm surprised you haven't mentioned the flowers. <laughs> yeah. So definitely will include um, a bit of prayer. I don't know how I'm going to actually layer this or anything. So I could include this in here as well. Oh, I, put, I did put out the numbers, my numbers, which are keeping this for a Roche packaging. Um, and we need a number five. That's what we definitely need. Actually, do we have it in any other colour? We've got the cream, or we've got, we've got the cream, or we've got the navy blue. See, there's nothing navy blue, is there, in this? Let me just go underneath. Do we have any? numbers nope okay so two options are I suppose that's a dark green could get away with it there's the orange fabric five yeah that might blend in more yeah let's use that somewhere because um, five o'clock, I'm I'm in the five o'clock club in the morning. I wake up at five o'clock. So that's part of um routine as well, isn't it? Just gonna add this adhesive. Okay, so from this, um, there was this that we had from the last project. I know there's lots of more pretty things left in here. Well, not that many, only a few. But there's this wallpaper as well, which I had. So let's have a little think. Actually, maybe we could use the, let's use the actual flow of the lines to create like arrows maybe okay, let's get rid of really small bits actually that's fine there actually, it doesn't even have to be arrow should we just leave it as it is just round it off a little bit And then let us place this. Okay, let's have a little think now. What part of this can we use? Maybe let's just tear this bottom bit off. Let me just pop, just pop that down, just so we get an idea of what it looks like. It's 
got to remember not to bulk this out too much as well. Literally just in a very thin layer if I can. So I'm like applying it and then scraping it off. Hopefully it won't dry too quick. Okay, so just thought let's correct, put that shape in just to create some interest, maybe. Let's do it. I think I need more glue. <laughs> oh, it's a daisy. Okay, yeah, let's do it this way. Okay, and then I'm wondering how can we do these interesting arrows, if at all. Hmm. We have them coming out from the top, maybe. One can they can pop out a little bit, can't they? Because it, it's this is quite thick. It's quite thick um, wallpaper. I definitely need some more. Actually, let's shall we double side these? Why not? Bend it slightly. <laughs> yeah, I do try it to when like when I turn when I sit in the car, turn the car on, I'll like well please Vigru protect us. So Vigru is um, another name for God. Va Vahiguru means like a wondrous lord. Oh, you're not sure what to do with that as well. Okay, so that's we've got to get so numbers are always about um, routine as well, isn't it? I'm sure everyone has completely different routines. This helps them um, just take off the straight edges here as well Actually, you can sit in there can't you can you no you're not going to pop out That needs to go a bit higher. Just add a bit more there. Okay. I've got to imagine. We've got read. Does it include doily to read? <laughs> Mm. 
no that, that this is way too big i think for this project bring this over here yes this can go in like a tag as well possibly first of all you need a background for this shall we just use this then or going to be too small it doesn't kind of go with any of the rest of the thingamajiggies does it so that green might go oh no it's going to be too busy it's too busy okay right we're going to have to And I'll create something here. It's a risk, but I'm going to just use some black oil pastel. to tone this down I could use um yeah let's get out the metallics as well one moment I think I've misplaced them. They're not in their usual spot. So I might just actually leave this in here until we think about what to do with it. This. Uh, shall we just separate that? Goodness me. Now you want to just cover the whole <laughs> Oh god. I say we go with this. And we're covering up the black. Do we want to add anything else behind? I need to pull out some more stuff really. Like generally. thinking about this just to use a bit of mm, it's kind of like a shelf isn't it oh my goodness that would be brilliant actually right right let's cut this out let's cut this out so we bought a I think it was a wooden toilet roll holder you know, like with the industrial pipe style design from this place. And this little um, card came in it. This is going to be a totally cool little shelf for these vase to sit on. Yes, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, I am going to use the dry adhesive so yeah I also try to eat healthy if I can 
I'm vegan, but I, I went plant based as well. Which does take a lot of willpower, hence why I was trying to bring in the brain. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not easy, but. Because every, every year I've just got stricter with myself, so I like quit oil, and then I was like, actually, sorry, just need to pinch a bit of this off, so we go right under the vase, there we go, and then I'm also, um, what am I trying to say? Yeah, oil and sugar free. Actually, we'll stick the re one reed down here and then the margin up there, shall we? Yeah. Imagine a nice routine. <laughs> Let's imagine a nice routine. Actually, we I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some vintage. No, not vintage at all. Get the black soot dauber quickly, and just add a bit of that, just so it matches what I've just done down there. Otherwise. Yeah, I'm still reading um Tom's school boys. Is it called Tom's school boys or something like that? School boy days? Oh my goodness, I don't even know what I'm reading, but I'm nearly halfway there. <laughs> I'm nearly halfway through it. Actually, I might just do it on the sh you know where it's quite sharp there. Okay, I'm gonna leave it at that now. Oops, it's sticking. Oh, you're all right. We could even like make some different designs. Oh, why not? Let's just do it. Oh, avalanche! God, I've got a sharpie permanent marker. This is an ultra fine one. I'm just going to create some because it's got leaves there just to create just some more interest with that very strange leaves but yeah we will, we will. We will still continue. And then we can do a swirl. And here. Actually, yeah, that looks cool. We'll weld it up. And we'll finish here. Connectors, I'll just add a few leaves to ones. Yeah. I'm going to finish there now. I hope you enjoyed that. So morning routine, 5am waking up, planning the day. You don't know where you're going, just follow, follow your heart. And praying, reading in the morning and doing what you have to do really. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that. See you tomorrow. Bye.